Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anna, if you're new here. Um, if you're not new here, welcome back. Thanks for returning. And in today's video, I thought I would show you my new skincare routine. Well, I shouldn't say new. We're trying to implement the more of my skincare into my nightly routine. But it's a struggle because I obviously need stuff to be adapted for me. So I'm just going to go through it with you guys real quick. And um, I'm going to take off my glasses, hand them to Maddie. And then also let's talk about... Um, what has been or pretty open for me. So, I've always had the struggle of opening containers such as this, like, I have a hard time with twisties or twists off, but, so, Maddie kindly has already done that for me. Also, usually in the circumstances that I have makeup on, you we take this oil, oh, and then somebody has to put it on there for me, and then I can um, mostly do after they do that stuff. I do it my can do it myself, but I have no makeup on today because I knew I was going to do this routine. So why put makeup on if you're going to take it off? You know what you're, what I'm saying? No. This is what we have. So this is, um, um, a face cleaner from Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, so you think the best way to do it is and this video will also show more thoughts about adapt, how to adapt it so that I can be my most independent self. But um, in full disclosure, my mom has been doing it for the past couple, well, since we started this routine, just because we haven't thought about how to, we, we don't know the best way to adapt it for me yet. But this is a container that like, do you use the food in? For like the, like when you were a little kid? Yes. Thank you, Maddie. Um, I have, we've had this container for years. And this is coconut oil, it's a good moisturizer. Oh, usually I do have this little ring, or this little uh, headband on that my mom got me for Christmas this year. But because my hair is already up, that's not gonna be necessary for t today's video. No, we've only done this I'm going to take this off. See you guys, see how long this takes me. Okay, now, let's try and do it. I don't know. It's so close. What do I do? Just push it down really, really wrong. <laughs> okay, got it. <laughs> Successful this time. Fold your hands on it. Fold your hands. <laughs> Okay. 
okay. I think that's good for now. Hold on, where do I, where do I turn this? Oh my God. Then I have to take it off so that I should take it off. Unfold the towel. And we're gonna take it off. Mm -hmm. Um, there we. Ha I have done a little bit of research about the container, because as you can see, there are some containers that I just can't do, like the oil. Um, like any spray bottle, I can't do myself. Um. What else? Oh, the like eyedropper containers. I think I would have a struggle bus time with as well. So, um, we've had it. Well, I've had it. I've done a little bit of research about. Airtight containers because um, I've learned the hard way to do stuff airtight, especially when there's like um, going from the like makeup slash skincare stuff because my foundation has been dried out before with no airtight. So I have two containers that I think could possibly work. Seriously. <laughs> no, I know how to say that too. Seriously, you guys, like, that stuff happens all the time to me. Is it on? No. Yeah, I don't like screw on containers. Because they're like, oh no. Here, you can do that manual and move on to the next step. So, like I was saying, uh, over here, um, like, bottles like this, or such as this and the oil. These don't work for me. I'm not sure what container to put the oil in. Um, to be most independent. So, let me know if you guys have any ideas because I don't know what to do as far as that goes. And then also we have Oh my god, can I stop dropping things today? I don't know. Stretch, stretch, turn. Okay, that actually comes with me and it has like a stand. Okay, so stay. Are you gonna stay? So we do have like this um, exfoliator <laughs> um, that we've been using. But we've had it like, we use it too often that like one of my spots on my sk skin is like raw. So we do do this first. Um, usually if I have to do, they say even to do that three, twice, two times a week or three times a week. Um, but we've done it enough that my skin is finally good. Can I have my little headband thingy? I'm thinking this is gonna be helpful, hopefully, for... Let's see if I can do it myself. I am like struggle lost right now. 
There, okay, I know this is not the prettiest look. On the universe right now. But we're gonna go with it. Oh, by the way, Maddie is my new um, technolo our technology assistant. So that's who I'm talking to. If, if, if I say Maddie or me, I need help or something like that. Um, how do I want to do this? I almost want to apply it to directly to my nose. It actually might be easier with my... I know this is not sanitary, but this is my bottle. Oh, too much. You can rub it all in. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Okay. Circular motions, circular motions. Circular motions, circular motions. There should be a song. So, I'm gonna actually wipe my hands and all that. Anyway, so, while Maddie's being my assistant and <laughs> making it warm, um, what was I gonna say? Oh. So for the gray one, if you guys ever want to use this, yeah, that one. Hold on. Oh. And then it's such a moment. Okay, just put it down there. So for that one in particular, it has to harden um, for 15 minutes. I want to say 15 or 10 minutes. But I would use like almost like my caregiver like used this whole like a makeup brush kind of thing and put it all over my nose because right here did I, did I put stuff right here too mm -hmm. okay that's where that's where most of my blackheads are um. We had to um, take a um, in in what is the word intermission? Yeah, intermission for video recording. So I'm gonna take the clinic, clinic, clinic. Yeah, clinic. Um, moisturizing. Is it, what is it? I can't see. Are you kidding me? Okay, I can't even open that. See, we gotta like figure out how to like. This is part of the video where I'm like, yeah. I can't do Tristolian bottle, but I can somewhat do is the flip up. I don't know. And I just didn't add them stalling it. Oh, I use the back of my hand too, or like the side of my hand sometimes. Because that, that helps the, or that's easiest for me. I guess you could use the beauty blender too. But I just use my hand because that way my hand, um, yeah, that's a good thing. You could actually use a beauty blender if you really want, wanted to. I didn't think of that until now. The coverage. Did that just spray? I think you're good. Okay, that was like... Okay, I think that it was good for right now. And then tonight, an hour before you go to bed, um, you do like L'Occitane 
um, oil and you just put it on your face uh, one hour before bread to let it bed be, not bread, bed, so that it, it gives it time to soak in. And, um, yeah, as you guys can see, this is an unapproved container because I can't do spray bottles for the, or the pump bottles. And so, yeah, this is another part of the, the struggle. So we'll do that later. But my face feels really good. <laughs> so, yeah. So that concludes this video so I don't run on. That concludes the video and I will um, see you guys next time. Bye, have a good day. And remember to keep on rolling.